We bought this from Bird's Eye View in China. You can eight, you can get it for about eighty-two dollars there. And this is a big airplane. It is a really amazing airplane. It's our heavy lift airplane. We've flown things like Batman. <laughs> Lego City Space Shuttle. Aliens. And we fly cameras with it. And we're really interested in the camera side of it. interested in the photojournalistic side of this airplane. The image you can get with our seaplanes off the ground but not too high. such a unique perspective and we just think it's amazing so in the long term we're working to do that really well the fields are going to more quadcopters in this we haven't done quadcopters yet but we're because we're still interested in planes and this is another plane that's really good for aerial view a few months ago, our paper ran an article about the lack of rain that we received and how the communities in the area get their water from the river, and the river was low. Whoa, it's awful close to that tree. And they had photojournalists come take a picture out from the bridge. But we don't think it was very good representation of the drought. So we took our Skywalker out and took our own picture. And here's some examples of that. And we think that this perspective is very cool. And this is kind of something we are aiming for in RC. The photojournalistic side of RC. So it's just an example of one of the cool things you can do in RC. And it's working good for that, even though it's a very big plane. We fly our Skywalker with twin motors. And when the batteries are going out, one battery goes out first. And this plane can just fly with one motor. We are coming and we have lost one motor. And the plane was yawing. We get full throttle and the cave came up and twists. Okay, we'll put it right down here. And then we decided that we'll just drop it and then land it. Just another cool thing about this plane. Go fly and have fun, Mercy Docks!